This week we're introducing viewers to one of the smallest residents at Big Cat Rescue, Canyon the Sand Cat. Canyon's parents were the offspring of wild-caught sand cats sent by the Saudi government to SOS Care, an international cat conservation organization in an effort to preserve the species during Operation Desert Storm. Sand cats are the only cat species found primarily in the desert and are native to northern Africa and southwest and central Asia. Canyon was sent to Big Cat Rescue on October 23, 2000, along with four other sand cats as a genetic backup in the case of disaster at SOS Care. He's a very shy cat and hides in the tall grass and ferns in his enclosure. But he's an awesome climber and makes it look very easy getting to and from his favorite barrel at the top of a tree, where he sleeps and inspects the world around him. Sand cats are primarily nocturnal, and it's always tricky for keepers to locate him in his enclosure. But Canyon is always ready and waiting at feeding time when he hears the food cart on its way. Tour guests that get to see Canyon often think he's a kitten or a domestic cat. So we have to explain to them that he's definitely a wild species of cat. And what he lacks in size, he makes up for in attitude. Canyon used to live in the middle of the sanctuary next door to Cameron and Zabu, but didn't seem the least bit concerned that his neighbors were a few hundred pounds heavier than he is. Recently, keepers spotted what looked like an ingrown claw on his front paw. Big Cat Rescue staff managed to get a better look at him at feeding time, and we decided to sedate him and check it out. While Canyon was sedated, we removed his ingrown claw, and you could clearly see the thick black hair that covers his paw pads. This protects their feet from the heat of the desert sand in the wild. It was also a great opportunity to do a full physical on Canyon. We trimmed all his other claws, took a blood sample, treated him with flea prevention, and finally weighed him. Canyon came in at a whopping 6.6 .6 pounds. And while Canyon was in the cat hospital recovering, we renovated a larger enclosure at the front of the sanctuary next to Hal and Aspen the cougars and Tricky the leopard cat. Of course, the sparrow made the trip to his new home, along with other favorite hiding places, and we also added a sand castle for him to explore. Sand cats hunt by digging, using their huge ears to locate prey above and below ground. Their diet consists of rodents, birds, reptiles, and snakes. They stun snakes with rapid blows to the head before moving in for the kill. They're also known to bury larger kills in the sand, then return later to finish their meal. So giving Canyon some sand to dig in and investigate was a good way to encourage some natural behaviors. He had lots of fun checking out his new space and making sure that others knew that this was his territory now. Canyon soon figured out his new feeding spot in the enclosure. He's on the feeding tour at the sanctuary, and this is definitely his favorite time of day. He loves chicken necks, and this is also when you're reminded that he's a wild cat. He is a little water bull, which is clean daily, just like the other 100 plus residents at Big Cat Rescue. But it rarely gets used, because sand cats can survive without water, using the body fluids from their prey to survive. We're so glad we could provide Canyon a home in captivity for the past decade. Of course, for wild sand cats, there's no shortage of desert but the vulnerable ecosystems within them are rapidly being destroyed by people and their activities, especially livestock grazing. Other threats for this little cat include the introduction of feral and domestic dogs and cats, foxes, wolves, larger cats like caracals, and because of their size, even birds of prey. This makes us feel even luckier to be caretakers for Canyon, our teacup tiger. He's a favorite for many volunteers, and any tour guest is lucky enough to get a look at him. If you'd like to sponsor Canyon, all 105 ounces of them, and to help us with our mission, please visit our website, bigcatrescue.org. You can help us change the way people treat big cats by texting the word TIGER to 20222.